So we are here with Christine Saplinski of the Reading Theatre Project in this beautiful Gaga workspace where they're rehearsing for, tell us about it. The Marriage Expose. Excellent, excellent. So what kind of show is it? Tell us, it, I, I know it's like a little bit interactive, mm -hmm. a little bit fun, different stations and you kind of walk around, but, right. but tell us what. Well, so Reading Theatre Project has come up with an innovative new show um, and it's an original piece that we've been working on for the last eight months. Uh, individuals within our group each took sections of marriage um, and issues surrounding that and wrote sort of spoofs on sort of services that we would like to have uh, in our relationships. Maybe you need a mother-in-law for the day and you don't have one, so you can go to the um, the surrogate mother-in-law extraordinaire booth and uh, she can rent you out a mother-in-law for the day that you could take to a party or maybe you need to shop for some sort of cocktail dress and you need her advice. Okay. Uh, that kind of it's thing. Is going to be food and beverage available? There is. Wine and beer, always good to go uh, with an experiential event like this. Uh, and there will be some food. We have uh, some Sweet Street desserts donated by Sweet Street Desserts. And um, we'll have other food and, and beverages available as well. We have sort of a vaudevillian style team that will be helping the host of the entire event uh, to sort of explain and showcase the various stages of marriage. So Reader's Digest and um, several religions uh, tout that there are seven phases of marriage and we explore every single one Excellent. from from passion to completion. Okay, so we, I could come and I could kind of walk around and experience different things, yes. or I could come and sit yes. and kind of watch it all unfold around me. Correct. So it's, it's very uh, very flexible, it's very cool. Yes. Right, so tell us where, tell us when. All right, so it's gonna be at the Olympian Ballroom on uh, Penn Avenue. Okay, so that's where Speakeasy was, Correct. right? Correct. Excellent. Exactly where Speakeasy was, right across the street from one of our main sponsors, the West Reading Tavern. And uh, it'll be on, it starts on May 2nd and it runs for a couple of weekends uh, to the next weekend, which is uh, May 10th. And there are several showings on all those days. Um, and so you just go to the website site which is readingtheaterproject.org and you can find all the information there that you need um, and you can order tickets online. In addition to like some of the fun stuff mm -hmm. there's also some serious stuff. There involved. are there is uh, there are some legitimate booths that will be dispersed throughout the event. Uh, we have um, a divorce lawyer who will be having her her booth there um, and we'll also have a, an abuse hotline uh, or an, an agency who deals with spousal abuse or domestic violence. Uh, so there will be at least those two things and then some other additional um, booths with legitimate services that may maybe you need. In addition to West Rain Tavern, I know you have some other sponsors as well. Pennsylvania Council of Arts uh, is a great sponsor of ours along with the Burks uh, Arts Council. And then we have the Why I'm Missing Foundation who's been great to us every single year. Um, and then Abnormal Tees. Abnormal Tees is a, a t-shirt uh, company and they're great to us. And then we have John Athens Photography. He's uh, going to be taking some of our photos for the production. And Flower Hill Farm is going to be uh, one of our main spots. It, it's just really nice to go through and, and explore what marriage means. And we had such a good time writing it. Uh, the actors are having a great time rehearsing it and I hope that the audience will have a wonderful time watching it or experiencing it, I should say. Excellent. So let's wrap it up. Give, you, give us the dates again. May t uh, 2nd to the 10th. Uh, various showings during those days. Go to readingtheaterproject.org and you can find all the information to buy tickets there. Great. Thank you so much for your time you. and we'll see you at the Olympia Ballroom. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>